we are just born with certain things that we can't change, like for example, the shape of our nose or the color of our eyes. But there are many things that we have the power over to change, which can enhance the attractiveness of our face. And in this video, I will go over the key things which will make your face more attractive. But before I get into it, I want to show you guys what my starting point was. This was me three years ago and I was very insecure about how my face looked like. And now with a little bit of time and hard work, I was able to make a huge difference. Of course, I still haven't achieved my ultimate goal yet and I'm still working on things. But personally, I would say I was able to make a pretty decent transformation. And if you watch this video till the end, then you will know exactly what will help you to make a transformation like this as well. And I can promise you, it's totally worth putting in a little bit of work into the appearance of your face. Because you will feel more confident, you will attract more of the other gender, and you will gain respect from other guys. And this is hugely beneficial. These days, everyone just wants to convince you to believe that your appearance doesn't matter. But at the end of the day, we are still just humans, and our brains haven't changed that much in the last 100 years. So, and on this note, let's right away start with the first thing, which will help you to change the appearance and attractiveness of your face massively. I actually think most people do have an attractive face. The only problem is that they're having too much fat in their face. And this definitely also was a problem that I've struggled with a lot. The problem I had is that I carried a lot of body fat in my face. But this is an individual thing. So maybe you're someone who carries a bit less fat in his face, but maybe a bit more around his stomach. This is all about our fat distribution. And sadly, we can't spot reduce fat. So the only choice that we have is to just lose body fat by going into a calorie deficit and then wait until the fat goes away where we want to get it away from. And now this might sound a bit discouraging and you think to yourself, you don't know how long you have to wait until your face actually looks lean. Well, I can tell you the good thing about this is that when we start losing a little bit of fat in our face, we will already see a massive difference. Even a few hundred grams less fat in our face will make a day and night a difference. So it is totally worth doing this. Whilst talking about losing body fat, I need to mention that there's a myth out there. Many people think they need to cut out the carbs to lose body fat. But I can tell you guys, carbs aren't the evil, it's all about the calories. At the end of the day, you can eat whatever you want to eat. It's just important that you eat less calories than you burn, and then you will lose body fat. Of course, if you want to get the very best results and make the best with your diet, then also try to eat healthy and nutritious foods. And this right away brings me to the second point, which is many people do have acne. And the best thing which cures this is improving our diet. I can say this again from my own experience. I did also have problems with acne until I changed my diet and started eating healthy and nutritious foods. So if you would have to rank on what we have to focus on the most on our diet is firstly the calorie intake and secondly the quality of the foods. And this also oftentimes goes hand in hand, because if you eat healthy foods, they oftentimes are also a bit lower in calories, and therefore you will lose body fat whilst eating healthy. And I can tell you, if you start eating like this on a regular basis, then you're already ahead of most people. Almost everybody these days is eating desserts and fast food all the time, and they don't have the discipline and willpower to actually eat healthy and make a change. But I do think that you can do it because you clicked on this video with a goal, with the goal of changing the attractiveness of your face. And now you're educating yourself on this, which most people aren't even doing. And now it's just important that you actually start following these tips because that's what makes the difference. All right, so if you start doing those two things, so you improve your skin and you start losing body fat in your face, then it's very likely that your face already looks extremely attractive. As I said, many people do already have an attractive face. 
it's just covered in fat and in a greasy skin. So these are two essential steps that we have to take. And now there's some extra things that we can do to take our results even to the next level. Now, many people already have heard about the term mu -ing. And I don't even want to be one of the guys who is telling you that you have to mew every minute of the day that you're awake. I just wanted to mention this point in this video is because I do think many people are breathing through their mouth all the time and keeping it open. And as we know, in the long term, this has many bad effects firstly on our health and secondly also on the shape of our face. So just ask yourself this question. Do you mostly breathe through your nose and keep your mouth closed? Or do you usually breathe through your mouth and keeping it open? I know it sounds like a weird question, but the thing is we humans should just naturally actually be breathing through our nose and keep our mouth closed. But because so many people aren't doing this, they might be a little bit sick and can't even get enough air through their nose. Because of that, the shape of their face changes a lot and they start getting a receding chin and a puffy face look. Now, if you answer this question with all honesty and realize that you actually mostly are breathing through your mouth, then the next time you realize that, just try to breathe through your nose. And if you can't get enough air through it, then get some nasal spray and do something about it because it actually over time will make a huge difference. Perfect. If we are doing all of the things I've just talked about, then we are on a great path on getting a very attractive face. But we have to think about it. If we just get leaner in our face, improve our skin and do the mewing stuff to improve the shape of our bones and everything, then we still not potentially have the very chiseled look because we can only get this from having well-developed muscles in our face. Here again, the problem is most people are eating junk food and desserts, which isn't training their jaw and their muscles in their face at all. But there are two ways how we can change that. One is of course changing our diet, which we are already doing with the first steps I've talked about in this video. Maybe in addition to that, you can also focus a bit more on eating foods which are a bit harder to chew because then our trauma will get stronger. But personally, one of the things which helped me the most is chewing gum. I'm someone who loves chewing gum, therefore it also wasn't difficult for me to do. But still, if you aren't doing this yet, then you need to get on this. I mean, imagine this. If you're chewing on gum, then you're actually specifically training the muscles on the side of your face, which will give you this sharp jawline chiseled face look that we all want. And it is so easy to do. I mean, imagine chewing on gum for about an hour or two. It's easy and for your body it's like a two hour jaw workout, which is perfect if you want to look attractive. So just buy yourself some cheap chewing gum, make sure it isn't with sugar because that again would be bad for our skin. And then you're all set. You can do this whilst working, whilst being at school or whatever you're doing. You can even chew gum at the gym if you want to. Your body doesn't care when you do it, it's just important that you do it. Great, and that's it. Those are all the things that I do on a regular basis and which help me to make my face transformation. No matter what your starting point is, if you start following these things and do them on a regular basis, then you will improve the looks of your face. There's no chance that you won't. These are just things most people aren't doing and they never educated themselves on what they actually have to do. And therefore, most people also don't have an attractive face. So if you want to change something about it, then you have to do what most people aren't doing. And because you've watched this video till the end now, you know about these things. So I hope you found this video helpful. If yes, then I would appreciate it a lot if you would like and subscribe. And then see you in the next one.